Hello and welcome. This is Neldrin and today, let's discuss the Flame Touch Dagger event and my impressions on the new ship, Fosh. But before that, if you haven't subscribed yet, here's the sign you are waiting for to hit the subscribe button. The Flame Touch Dagger event will be from November 11th to the 24th. In this event, you have to accumulate points by completing SP maps to get Fosh. Although you can get her via construction, I don't recommend spending a lot of cubes, since the odds are small and rate up is a lie. You need to complete the SP3 map more or less 60 times to get Fosh. You can use the high efficiency plan if you want to complete the milestone immediately. Bringing at least one of any of the following ships will also increase the points you will get. Make sure that they are in the boss fleet, else the bonus reward won't be given. SP maps have many boss nodes which are almost the same as the humanoid or siren fleet from other events. But this one will not move around the map. These enemies give more XP points, so I advise you to play the SP maps if you need to level up low-level ships. SP maps have an oil cost limit once cleared. You can bring a full fleet here without worrying about the oil cost. Other than acquiring Fosh, there's nothing to farm in the SP maps, unless you don't have Latorio's gun yet. So overall, the SP maps are good for XP farming, but not for resources, like coins, ships, or equipment. Now let's have a quick look at Fosh. She's an elite rarity, heavy cruiser. Visual design, she looks like one of the Kingdom Knights from ReZero. Also, don't forget to enhance her, if you know what I'm talking about. Her attributes are average, with a high torpedo, anti-air, and speed stat. She's in Vicia Dominion, so she will receive defensive buffs from Richelieu. However, I don't think she will be a good tank, due to below average HP and evasion. Her yellow skill increases her firepower and AA. She also reduces the out of ammo debuff for herself. I think the skill is decent, given that this will improve her already good AA, and make her firepower from weak to average. The effect on out of ammo debuff is negligible since it only affects her. Her red skill will increase her damage to heavy and large cruisers. And every 20 seconds, there is a huge chance to increase her accuracy and reload for 10 seconds. I think this is a decent skill for her. Given that she has good all-out assault with the reload buff, this will make her fire it more frequently. However, remember that she has average firepower, so she won't hit hard as expected. So overall, Fosh is a decent ship up to mid-stages. If only her skills complement her strong torpedo stat, then she might be a good ship. She got a good reload and all-out assault, but she doesn't have the firepower to complement it. The only saving grace is her good AA, but since she doesn't offer anything other than that, might as well use a better ship for stages 12 and 13. But to summarize, the Flame Touch Dagger event is a good source for XP farming. But there's nothing else to farm other than that. And accumulate points to get Fosh which is a decent ship up to mid stages. I hope that you get Fosh as soon as possible. And if you want to take it easy, feel free to do so since two weeks is plenty of time to reach the milestone. And don't forget to subscribe and share this video to support my channel. You guys are awesome and see you next time.